Welcome to an introduction to the IS32LT3175 automotive LED driver. This presentation will provide an overview of the features and benefits of the IS32LT3175 for automotive interior lighting. Automotive LED applications are quickly evolving and replacing traditional incandescent light bulbs. Not only do LEDs provide high reliability and long life, they also increase fuel efficiency. For example, a typical automobile using traditional bulbs could consume up to 14.5 amps during night driving. Replacing all those bulbs with LEDs can bring down the current requirement to about 2 amps. In horsepower terms, this translates to a 12% reduction resulting in greater miles per gallon with less fuel consumption. ISSI is focused on designing new and innovative analog semiconductors for the automotive market which requires AEC Q100 qualification, a rigorous qualification process with support for long-term supply and long production cycles. LEDs are current driven devices with a characteristic IV curve and a characteristic forward voltage which needs to be exceeded in order to turn on the LED. Once the forward voltage is exceeded, the LED's resistance begins to decrease causing the LED to draw greater current and potentially burn out. A resistor is typically used in series with the LED to limit the current and prevent LED burnout. However, any variation in resistor voltage resulting from temperature, supply voltage variation, or some other effect will cause a proportional variation in the LED current resulting in variation of LED brightness. The ultimate solution to driving LEDs is to use an LED driver with a constant current regulator to provide the exact LED current regardless of variations in supply voltage or temperature. LED driver IC solutions provide the optimum current for longevity and increased reliability of LEDs. In addition, because LED drivers are semiconductor devices, they can integrate special functions for advanced LED control. The IS32LT3175 represents a simple yet elegant approach to interior automotive LED lighting. It is a constant current regulator with features such as gradual fade up, down of a light source to convey a certain elegance to any lighting application. Typically this feature sometimes called theatrical dimming can only be accomplished with a microcontroller. The IS32LT3175 accomplishes the same eye-catching dimming transitions without a microcontroller, without programming. The IS32LT3175 is a feature-rich AEC Q100 Automotive Electronics Council certified LED driver that integrates a programmable 150 milliamp current source, push-button control, PWM input, and configurable fade-in or fade-out lighting control. The device comes in a thermally enhanced 8-pin package and is designed for use in map lights, dome lights, door lights, and other automotive interior lighting applications. The IS32LT3175 is a linear, single-channel, constant current source incorporating resistor programmable features. A single resistor, RI set, programs the current source to a value between 10 milliamps and 150 milliamps. Two other resistors set the theatrical dimming speed, RT setup sets the on dimming time, while RT set down sets the off dimming time. There are two methods to control the LED dimming, with a momentary contact switch or with a BCM PWM pulse stream input. Automobiles have a microcontroller and a body control module which will send out a pulse width modulated PWM dimming signal when a door is opened or closed. 
This PWM signal will directly drive the IS32LT3175 current source to gradually turn on the LED when a door is opened and gradually turn it off when it is closed. Because the BCM PWM signal, sometimes referred to as the courtesy light signal, can be positive or negative polarity, ISI offers two versions. IS32LT3175P for positive polarity, which is the most common, and IS32LT3175N for negative polarity. The IS32LT3175 was designed as a low-cost enabler for elegant lighting in automotive, airplane, train, and commuter bus interior cabins. For cost reduction purposes, these applications typically implement a momentary contact button to turn on and off the light source. Two problems arise from this use. One, pressing the momentary button results in many signal transitions which need to be cleared. And two, the state of the on-off needs to be remembered. The IS32LT3175 resolves both of these issues by integrating a debound circuit and a memory latch to keep track of the button operation status. In addition, the IS32LT3175 can maintain the memory latch state even during automotive start-stop conditions where the battery voltage dips to 6 volts for a few milliseconds. This video shows how the LED lights remain at the previous state even though the DC plug adapter is removed and reinserted showing a dimming of the lights and they come back to the previous state. This state diagram shows how the active low going pulse generated by the momentary contact button has priority of the dimming state. The BCM PWM signal can drive the IS32LT3175 to turn on and off the LED light as shown in state 1. In the next state 2, a button press causes a low going pulse to the IS32LT3175 which turns on the LED and the second pulse turns off the LED at the fade speed set by the fade resistors. Notice the BCM PWM signal is ignored when the LED is enabled with the button press. In state 3, the BCM PWM initially turns on the LED and a pulse from the button turns off the LED independent of the BCM PWM signal. States 4 and 5 show the momentary contact button will turn on and off the LED independent of the BCM PWM. Finally, the last figure shows the fast response of the momentary contact button. The turn on and off cycles can be terminated or initiated mid-cycle with every press of the button. This video shows the function of the momentary contact button to turn on and off the LEDs. The black knob is a PWM source which is used to turn on and off the LEDs. What is demonstrated is the momentary contact button overrides the PWM source. Next we are demonstrating how variable potentiometers can be used to adjust the fade speed of the LEDs both on and off. Next, we are demonstrating how the momentary contact button can quickly turn on and off the LED at mid-cycle. This is a simplified block diagram of the IS32LT3175 device. Notice the IS32LT3175 in version integrates a PWM inverter for operation with a negative polarity BCM signal. The PWM out and VCC pins are all capable of sustaining a maximum of 45 volts. The remaining pins are 7 volt tolerant. This is an example of how a microcontroller based LED light can be simplified by using the IS32LT3175 device.
The original solution on the left in white PCB required a pre-programmed MCU, four transistors, three Zener diodes, and various discrete resistors and capacitors for a total of 43 components. The equivalent form fit an improved functional solution using the IS32LT3175 requires only 19 components, the majority being resistors and capacitors, with only one diode for reverse battery protection. A design requiring less components not only reduces cost, it also increases reliability since there are less components to fail. Using the IS32LT3175 can result in a 55% bomb reduction, a smaller PCB, and increased reliability. The IS32LT3175 is a single channel, low noise, low EMI linear LED driver which can be adjusted from 10 to 150 milliamps. It easily interfaces to a low cost momentary contact switch for local master control of the LED light source. A PWM signal from a remote automotive microcontroller can also drive the LED light source, but it is subject to the momentary contact switch. All the features and functions are configured with simple resistors. There is no need for a local micro. The IS32LT3175 was designed for automotive applications and is fully AECQ100 compliant. In summary, the IS32LT3175 represents a simple yet elegant solution for automotive cabin lighting which will result in significant cost reduction and increased reliability. ISSI provides a complete portfolio of LED driver and audio solutions fully qualified to AEC Q100 standards. For more information, please contact analog at ISSI.com. This concludes the product presentation. Thank you for your time.